I get this question all the time. Like, Jeremy, well, what can I buy shoes for resale that are legit? Where can I? There's. Hoping one day I'ma get it all right. Brother is engaged, but I start a new life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating, not scrolling. Mom and dad still support it. All right, man. I'm back with another video, man. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe button, and feel free to comment down below. All right, so let's go ahead and just jump straight into this topic, right? So, full disclaimer from my end. This video. I was originally gonna give you guys some resale sites that I recommend that you can shop at for real, like authentic sneakers. But reality is, with what I've been preaching, it just didn't line up to where my morals is and I didn't wanna stir you guys in the wrong direction. Now, with that being said, me, personally, I no longer buy sneakers for resale, right? I don't care if it's coming off of Michael Jordan's barefoot himself. And le well, that's different. If I see, the <laughs> I don't care. You know what I mean? I, unless it's coming off directly from somebody who has a Nike account or somebody who has like direct connection with Nike or Jordan, then no, I'm not buying for resale. So I was gonna give you guys a few sites of where I used to buy sneakers for resale in the past, but honestly, all these resale companies have been caught like with selling fakes or now, Let's just make this out to be that. Like, I'm not saying they were willingly known of selling fakes, but what I'm saying is they always end up getting caught up where, you know, they have to work with it. And let's face it, all these resale companies, what's the number one thing they all have in common? And I'll tell you, they don't wanna do no exchanges, no refunds, no nothing, right? That's my biggest problem. So I can't really support that from your biggest to like StockX to your little guys to like, soul supremacy you know and i ain't saying they those are little guys because they're big in the resale game too but the number one thing they all have in common is they don't really like to do exchanges and returns you know in my opinion if you're a legit seller of anything you will be comfortable with doing a refund you know that's the number one red flag to me of like if you're legit or not and i'm not here to you know say that there isn't any legit resellers because there are a few, you know, and I've heard about them, this, that, and the third, but I've never shopped with them, so I don't wanna just give you guys that information, right? Because I had a couple where I was gonna throw their name out there, but reality is I never shopped from there, so I don't want you guys to be catching that first bad experience. Number one thing that I recommend is to just be patient. Being a sneakerhead requires patience, and it's not, or with, that's the, the problem with majority of people that are in the sneakers. You want the latest and greatest thing and sure go ahead take a risk and buy the shoe for resale because let's face it nike's not helping us adidas not helping us i mean sure they do restocks here and there but then we got to worry about the bots i got another video coming about the bots at a later date how i feel about those and we can discuss that as well but today i'm just focusing strictly on reselling and like I said, I'm not gonna throw out any company's name or any recommendations. I get this question all the time. Like, Jeremy, well, what can I buy shoes for resale that are legit? Where can I? There's, there's tons of sites out there, right? But I guarantee you for every site that you find, you will find that somebody has received a fake, right? So at the end of the day, man, you would have to buy at your own risk and you know how it is when you get it in hand you're about to not saying you can't get a refund because i've proven that in previous videos that you can get a refund but you are gonna have to work at it you know what i'm saying it's, they don't just hand it to you right you know what i'm saying they're gonna argue it's kind of your words against theirs and in today's like this year 2020 of sneaker releases these shoes are spot on and then you know i feel like nike should do something however I get it why they, what can they really do because it's gonna still be duplicated. But at the end of the day, man, I'm gonna keep it simple with about buying sneakers for resale, right? I'm not here to bash any other resellers. I just don't mess with resellers in general. I don't buy shoes for resale anymore. Have I bought shoes for resale in the past? Sure. But then it didn't take me long to wise up to be like, hey, one, who's to say that they are saying, who qualifies them to say that this shoe is legit? Once you figure that out, and I feel like that's where the reseller is gonna have to do for me. I don't need no, I don't want no story of 
you and your staff are qualified to legit check, because you're not. Let's just stop the story right there. Where are you getting them from? I don't care how you get it. And yeah, I do care about the price, but like most of these resale companies, they use consignment, which means somebody else sells it. You know, they get it from somebody else who says they're legit and you know, to the naked eye, everything checks out. But everybody I know, I know everybody's having that problem of like, is it still legit though? Because you're not getting it directly from like somebody who has a Nike account at this point. So, at this point, if you if you were, let me put it this way, if you were comfortable with the people that you bought from for resale, my exposed videos would not get the views they get because obviously that means somebody's received a fake because I'm very good at calling these companies out, right? And I'll just leave it at that, right? I ain't gotta say no company's name in this video. Although I probably dropped a few names, but needless to say guys, I just wanna keep this short, sweet, and simple to the point. I don't buy shoes for resale, so I get this question all the time. I cannot recommend any sneaker resale shop. And you can still research and Google and try your luck and let me know how it goes. I'm not gonna buy from them because one of the prices and two, they they don't have, nine times out of 10, they don't have a Nike account. And the one person that I think that's even remotely close to even having one, I'm pretty sure that what they them reselling a sneaker is may not be illegal but i'm sure how they're getting it i'm pretty sure nike would not be even comfortable with that so i didn't even want to drop their name in this video and i'm not saying that i'm mr safe haven and i'm a good guy and i don't ever do anything illegal under the table however when it comes to my hard earned working money that i work for myself yeah and the words of the urban necessities owner I'm gonna need you to bat a thousand because he says no one bats a thousand. That's what he said. But if you feel like how I feel, for what I'm paying for a resale, yeah, you, I'm gonna need you to bat a million. You know what I mean? I'm gonna need you to get it right out the park. And if you're not sure at the end of the day, I don't want to buy from you. So, and I'm gonna just leave y'all with that. So I know a lot of you were expecting like me to give you a list of like the best resale companies but reality is man there is no best resale company not anymore especially not today and it's not their fault i'm gonna throw that out there too it's not their fault it's just that fakes have gotten really really good you can't really tell with the neck and eye no more there's no way you can get experience you know what i'm saying you can't go to school for that i've already put that out there but that's a whole nother video anyway i'm gonna go on and get up out of this video this was a little bit of a rant video but i had to be serious i know i said that i was gonna drop some list of where to buy shoes for resale but reality is there isn't none that i trust personally so if there is some that you trust sound out in the comment section let me know down in the comment section how you feel about this video i'm gonna go on and get up out of here man y'all know what to do go ahead and hit that like button subscribe button and feel free to comment down below again my name is jeremy jones and thank you for watching and i'm out oh and i just woke up from a fat nap <laughs> so i'm gonna make raps in my room <laughs>